Radical gun confiscation and gun registration, not just for coastal liberal states anymore. Hi, I'm Ryan Frazier, the Deputy Director of Political Operations for the National Association for Gun Rights, with reprehensible news out of Minnesota. Taking a page out of Congress's playbook, last week a committee composed entirely of Democrats injected SF-2909, a massive budget bill with red flag gun confiscation and a private sale ban slash gun registry. And late last night, this gun control Trojan horse was passed out of the Minnesota State Legislature entirely with Democrat support. This absurd bill is now headed to the desk of Governor Tim Walls, who has already indicated his intentions to sign it into law. So before you continue, please, if you have not already, take a moment to subscribe to the National Association for Gun Rights YouTube channel to keep up to date on critical 2A news. You can also text the number on your screen to join our text list and get immediate updates on gun control fights as they develop. And if you want to get in the fight to restore your gun rights, you can click the links in the description to sign our petitions opposing gun control. We will deliver your signed petitions to your lawmakers on our dime. Lastly, be sure to visit gunrights.org to learn more. Okay, back to the terrible news out of Minnesota. As I stated before, the bill that advanced last night was injected with red flag gun confiscation and a ban on private firearm sales that includes gun registration. Nothing more than government blessed swatting, red flag gun confiscation allows disgruntled anti-gun individuals to report gun owners and have SWAT teams dispatched to confiscate legally owned firearms with zero due process whatsoever. It is a blatant violation of the Second and Fourth Amendments to the U.S. Constitution. Additionally, a ban on private firearms sales was also included in this bill package. This provision makes it illegal for law-abiding Minnesotans to buy a firearm without going through a NICS gun registration check. At the time of this recording, Governor Tim Walls has not yet signed this anti-gun bill into law. So please, if you live in Minnesota, take a moment to call Governor Walls at 651-201-3400 and urge him to veto SF-2909 immediately. But I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Governor Walls is a rabidly anti-gun Democrat and he is likely to sign this gun grab any day. If he does, Minnesota will join gun control cesspools like California, Colorado, Delaware, Maryland, New Jersey, New York, Oregon, Vermont, and Washington that already have both these provisions on the books. That's pretty shameful company for a state which has a proud tradition of outdoorsmanship and responsible gun ownership. If you don't live in one of these states, let this be your warning. Take it from me, I'm recording this video from Colorado a former red state which over time has sold its soul to the gun control agenda. So please, I implore you, vote like your gun rights depend on it, because frankly they do. But it takes more than voting. If we're going to save our Second Amendment rights, it is critical gun owners activate and remain in the fight to defeat gun control in all of its wicked forms. And the best way to keep in the fight is by joining the National Association for Gun Rights, America's only no compromise gun rights organization. If you do live in one of these gun control dystopias, believe me, we hear you and we are fighting for you. Armed with our legal branch, the National Foundation for Gun Rights, we are actively pushing lawsuits against anti-gun laws in many of the previously mentioned states. And it only takes one legal victory for the whole gun control house of cards to come crumbling down. But it's only through the generous support of our members that we are able to fight the good fight for the Second Amendment. Which is why I'm asking you to join us today. Become a member, sign your petitions, make as generous a contribution as you can, and remain vigilant. For the National Association for Gun Rights, this is Ryan Frazier thanking you for your activism. Remember, if you're watching this, you are the resistance.